Shalom Israel. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka, Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone. And peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the prophets, the whole four elect, 144,000, and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Back with another lesson. I'll title this one: uh, "Turn your sorrow, turn your sorrows into joy. Turn your sorrows into joy. Call Halal Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Call Halal Yuma Alahaya Nawah Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai." And back with another lesson. Um, and as the title reads, you know, turn your sorrows into joy. Um, and this is what the Lord is preparing for, um, you know, his, 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 you know, starting with the elect, his men, the teachers, the prophets. This is what the Lord is, before, is preparing. See, um, and on down to the uh, um, uh, to the men and women that, that, you know, to the men out of his people that are not teachers, that are friends of the prophets and right along with the um you know, the women, the women, the Aquaf out of the tribes, the few women that are, um, you know, believers on uh, Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai. Um, and, you know, the the day to day, um, you know, uh, you know, battles and, you know, all the, you know, starting with the, 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 the leadership in this country here in America, Babylon, you know, the leadership is, um, you know, it's corrupted and on down to a good majority of our people, you know, um, you know, the, 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 the uh, you know, it's being stuck in poverty, um, you know, being being mocked. The Lord is He's the Lord is mocked in this place, America, Babylon. He's completely mocked. And then on down to his his men. You know, preaching his word, walk, walk you know, rehearsing the righteous acts of being mocked. You know, um, you know, some of our people they just don't believe. And, and, they, and they go and do wickedness all day long and they don't repent. You know, uh, uh, you know Esau to trying to fem, fem, uh, feminize the, the men. He's turning men into women and the women into men and, and deceiving your children. Let me go here. I mean, I'm, I don't want to make this too long. Just a quick hit, something that's on my spirit. But the Lord is getting ready to He's getting ready to shut the power off uh, in this place. Because it's just too corrupted. It's too it's too corrupted here in this place, America Babylon. Every kind of danger is coming. Let me go um, Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes 7 and 3. Ecclesiastes 7 and 3 It says It says Sorrow is better than laughter Sorrow is better than laughter For by the sadness of the continents The heart is made better Sorrow is better than laughter For by the sadness of the continents The heart is made better You see when you're going through something, you know, uh, 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 it, you know, it refines you, man. When you're going through something, when you're going through some suffering, it, 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 it refines you, man. It says four, it says the heart of the wise is in the house of mourning. The heart of the wise is in the house of mourning. But the heart of fools is in the house of mirth. See? And here in this place, America, Babylon, it's about partying 24-7. There ain't nothing wrong with, you know, having some fun. 
but this, this you know they promote party 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 seven days a week all day every day it's all about pleasure a good majority of our people is just about pleasure with them and then you know uh, uh, this is why the Lord said you know um, you know uh, uh, they, they you know roughly paraphrasing but basically you know they don't want to take counsel from from the Lord so he he gave them over unto their own own counsel you don't want to listen to what the Lord is telling you, so I'm going to give you over onto, onto your ideas on what you think is going to work for you, Jake. And, and look at it. Look at how it turns out for you every single day. Because you don't want to hearken to, to your power, man. And then you wonder why things go wrong. And then you don't want to be corrected. You don't want to be corrected. You got it all figured out. The Lord said, the heart of the wise is in the house of mourning, but the heart of fools is in the house of mirth. And if you if you know the times right now that we're in, you, this ain't the time to be in no mirthy spirit. You, you, it's time to be getting yourself together with the Lord, man, because judgment is coming. Let me go here. See? See? Let me go here. I'll go uh I'll just close out with these these last couple. And this is basically the point right here, man. John John 16 Because this is the spirit that the uh the Lord's servants are in. You know, the they're in a they're in a in a state of mourning right now, vexed with all this un ungodly behavior that's going on here in this place, America, Babylon, and even throughout the world, man. This ungodly behavior. And a good majority of our people, they don't want to hear this word, man. They want to hear smooth messages. They don't want to hear the truth. Uh, John 16 and 16. I'll close out with these 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 last few. It says, and this is Yahweh Shema Shai talking to the disciples. It says, John 16 and 16. It says, A little while and ye shall not see me. And again, a little while and ye shall see me, because I go to the Father Yahweh. 17. It says, Then said of his disciples among themselves what is this that he saith unto us they're asking what is he what is he saying it says a little while and ye shall not see me and again a little while and ye shall shall see me and because i go to the father 18 it says they said therefore what is this that he saith a little while we cannot tell what he said and this is what the disciples is asking us so what, what is he talking about a little while and you're not and you won't see me he said Yahweh 19 he said Yahweh Shema Shai uh, it says now Yahweh Shema Shai knew that they were uh, the serious um, to ask him and said unto them they didn't know what he was talking about it says do you so Yahweh Shema Shai said, do, do ye inquire among yourselves of that I said a little while, and ye shall not see me? It says, and again, a little while, and ye shall see me. 20, it says, verily, verily, I say unto you, that ye shall weep and laminate, but the world shall rejoice. See? But the world shall rejoice and ye shall be sorrowful. And this is the spirit right now that uh, the Lord's servants are in, man, because we're vexed. A good majority of our people, they, they just don't believe in this and they don't want to get right, man. They don't believe. They don't believe and they don't want to get right. They want to do what they want to do. There's no order. There's no order. 
There's lies, corruption. See? And and, and here it is, because the Lord told you, I'm gonna send you, I'm gonna send you as a sheep in the in the midst of wolves. These people are wolves out here, man. Every kind of evil and wickedness is going on in this place, America, and throughout and throughout the world, man. So we're we're vexed, being mocked and laughed at and called crazy, and uh, you know the Lord being uh, mocked. So it's like you know complaining to the Lord constantly, man. How long of this, man? You got friends and family members that, that just don't believe and you know uh, they mock and scorn and laugh but the writing is all over the wall on what's about to happen and they can't see it so we see what's going on around the world and in this place America things ain't right it ain't what it used to be it ain't what it ain't what it used to be. It's, things have completely changed, and it's gonna get even worse because the Lord is He's bringing that judgment. So He said, He said, and ye shall be sorrowful, but, but, the Lord said, but your sorrow, huh? But your but your sorrow shall be turned into joy. See? So the Lord, uh, you know, all the prophecies about uh, the war, the kingdom against kingdom, nation against nation, the uh, 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 the perilous times, the uh, uh, you know, all the prophecies that the Lord, the famine, the pestilence, the sicknesses, the destruction, the chaos, all of this is unfolding. This is the Lord turning this, the, 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 the sorrow into joy because the Lord's servants know this the prophecies what he's saying is coming true and judgment is going forth and so the, the, the starting with the men of the Lord his people the, the, the prophets man have been warning our people and here it is it's manifesting and it's I told you but it's really going to hit home uh, uh, when that RFID, that C hip, where no that mark, where no man could buy or sell, and then ultimately uh, that that uh, that that uh, the ICBM, those missiles when they hit, and that great deliverance, that's that, that that's going to be the ultimate joy, man. When that Lord put the, the that that. Uh, uh, um, uh, that uncorruptible crown that uh, on you and you're delivered see so uh, all this destruction going on and uh, we wanting our people to get right and the destruction increases this is the this is the Lord turning uh, uh, our, our our sorrow into joy man but it's really gonna be it's gonna hit home uh, ultimately being delivered out of this man because this is what this is about when the Lord in his second return you want to be protected in this time of trouble and you want to be delivered you want to be saved man out of this this is what this is what this is all about being delivered Shalom